Welcome to Talbot TV. Hi, how you doing? <laughs> no bad. I know you've been asking every week to get on, but oh, aye, aye. you know. <laughs> no, so anyway, uh, Saturday coming up, come look at home, Scottish Cup. Could it get any more exciting? Oh, these are the games you're in it for, to be honest. Uh, big matches like this, big crowd, local derby. Aye, look, you don't get much bigger than this. I must have seen a few of these ties in your time. Aye, look, uh, we've managed to win a few and uh, I remember losing a big one, mind you, I think it was a quarter final of the cup where uh, Campbell Money was in charge of coming at the time and we, it went to a replay at Beechwood and we lost in penalties. Yeah. I actually remember that one more than the, the ones we won, believe it or not. It was a hard one to take that day. It was a real downer for for the team and me personally as well. It was a, it was a hard one to take. We were, we were in front in both games actually and, and couldn't quite get there. Uh, and the goal equalised way was a bit of a freak for me. It was a, a goal for the shy line, I'll never forget it. And how it went in at the angle, I'll never know. But uh, well, you've got to move on and take it and uh, be stronger. For we shouldn't it. have bothered motivating for this game. We've got to remember uh, this is the one at home. It really matters to the fans, this one. Uh, we're well aware of that, so but that shouldn't be a problem. Uh, been better than the last game, mm -hmm. is, is what I'm concerned about. We, obviously, we lost the last game against Coburn and uh, we need to try and be better than that this time uh, or else we'll finish out the cup. We need to sort things out and uh, as I say try and iron a few things out. Well, we lost, it was a tight match you know that and it was a bit of a, uh, it was a penalty actually a harsh decision but they ha that happens you need to be able to beat uh, bad decisions sometimes. Uh, we won the good enough on the day uh, so well, my main concern has been, been much better than we were against uh, Coburn Lee. Uh, no, it's no disrespect in Coburnley, certainly, but uh, mm -hmm. we need to try and be, play better than that day. Always hard to, to retain it, aye, that's the one. Uh, it's always hard to... Everybody's fighting against you there. Uh, they've got, whoever you draw, I know it's coming, and they only need much motivation for that game. Uh, but, I've been doing well. So. Oh, look, they're in form. I think it's 10 unbeaten there. Uh, and they're doing really well. John's come in and done great. Uh, get his inside bolt there. And they're winning form, which is always good. Doesn't matter whether it's a league below or whatever. They're confident. They're winning form. So I, I know the bookies has got his favourite, but we don't see it that way. It's a derby match, and it can go your way.
welcome to Talbot TV, John. Thank you very much for coming in by on. So, just catch up with you about the big game we've got on Saturday. Um, how are you feeling about that? Forward to it, obviously, as well. Um, it's, a, it's a massive occasion whenever these two teams meet, you know. So, it's, uh, it's exciting for fans, it's exciting for coaches, and obviously, it's exciting for the players as well. So, yeah, we're, we're definitely looking forward to it. So, no trouble with the motivation then? Eh, half and all, I don't, I don't think so. Uh, I, was, I was lucky enough to play in a few of these games as a player, and it's one thing uh, the manager's team talk about it doesn't need to be too long on Saturday because everybody will be well up for it, especially with the, the extra onus of it being the Scottish Cup. So we'd won nine in a row and we drew our last um, competitive game with, with Largs, but um, right. yeah, we've been in decent form with, with all lots of games since September, so obviously we want to keep that run going as long as we can, and uh, although we're, we're underdogs, we've won we a wee bit of confidence, as you say. You've had success over Tucker before, I understand when you're at Wisha. Yeah, that's right. Um, that was a good few years ago now, well, it seems like a lifetime ago. Um, yeah, we wish on the central second division and we do up in Lake in the West at um, Beltane Park and wish on obviously I think that day we were something like 20 to 1 or something and we managed to, to turn them over so uh, it would be nice to repeat the feet on Saturday. That's for sure. We had that cup final, I think uh, we actually lost it, but uh, just the crowd and the, the, the anticipation of it was, was fantastic. I had just came to, to seniors football and I, I've got to be honest here, I was surprised at how well supported the two clubs were and how professional they were with their setups and the way they run. Uh, it's fantastic to be involved in. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, now in January and stuff, uh, are you look, looking to strengthen the squad going on or do you feel that you've got a squad here that can carry you through? I think we will. I think it, you need to freshen things up a wee bit, but it's just make sure it's the right ones that come in, you know, and uh, you just need to wait for their availability. Um, mm -hmm. We are going well, so there's no real, as you said, real, real necessity to go and do it, but if somebody comes up to catch his eye, yeah, we definitely look to strengthen. Yeah, great player. Uh, okay, and uh, the regeneration of the park, how, how's that proceeding? Yeah, well, so it's, it's been a wee bit of a hold up with it, with the, with the drainage and the flood prevention scheme, so that's a wee bit disappointing as we are looking forward to getting the as soon as we can, but these things have always had glitches and uh, we're lucky enough that we're going to have such a fantastic facility and it'll be we'll stand come looking to stay for years to come. Well, John, thank you very much and all the best luck for Saturday. Thanks very much. We'll see yes. you then. Thank you.